So, Joe, you've been named as the Island Under 21's captain for the upcoming campaign. How does that feel? Uh, obviously, I'm, I'm dead proud of it. Um, I think so obviously it's an honour to be captain of your, of your country for Under 21s. Um, yeah, I'm buzzing. Can't wait to can't wait to get going, get into some games. From you would have played with a lot of the leaders in the last campaign, and your midfield partner was Connor Coventry, the last Under 21s captain. Is there anything that you perhaps can take from Connor that look to bring into the new campaign? Yeah, 100%. Connor was Connor was class. Um, everything on the pitch, off the pitch, um, a top top leader, and he's great great for us last year, and so important for for how well we did um, in the campaign. Especially, especially the way you just talk to everyone off the pitch. I think that's definitely, definitely something which I can I can learn from. And having been in the last two camps with him, um, it's given me a good opportunity to watch him, to to learn off him. And then there's other boys as well who was doing it. Um, Leo Connor, um, Brian Ma. I think we need more than more than one leader in the group. So if we can carry on the way the boys did it in the last campaign into this one, it will uh, will be set will be set well. Being made under 21's captain, um, it's the latest in a very eventful last six months. You know, you've made your Premier League debut, you signed a new contract, you made your under 21's debut too. Have you had time to sort of sit down and reflect, or is it perhaps that's something you'll look to do towards the end of the season? Um, not really, I don't think. It's just been all the past six months have been mental, to be honest. Um, it all kicked off really getting my first start for the 21's, uh, making my debut in September in Israel. And then since from then it's just just gone a bit mad. Um, but no, it's, it's been great. I'm just trying to just trying to enjoy it, um, try and do the best I can from it, and land me here now. So um, yeah, I'm buzzing. And what experiences have you have really stood with you in the last few months? You know that you feel you could take going forward at international level. Well, definitely, definitely my, my debut for the 21s out in Israel. Um, I think especially for for the start of this campaign. I think. All the boys who who were there in Israel remember how that made us feel, and we, we don't want to don't want to like that again. We want to qualify this time, um, so that's definitely a major thing that that was, um, I think a few of us are, are looking to try and build on. Um, and then obviously all my experiences with with Wolves um, is going to help me be a better player, help me be better for Ireland. So um, anything I can take from the past six months is going to be useful for me. So looking more towards the group that we've been drawn with and you know how yourself as a leader can go through yeah. how important is the game against Iceland on Sunday to kind of start off on a positive front foot yeah it's, it's that important it's the first game first game we've had together as a group um, so it's, it's a completely new group a lot of us don't know each other yet we're still getting to know each other uh, so I think the, the earlier we can get out and, and play together the better it's only going to help us in the long run for this campaign um, I think everyone's buzzing to go everyone's uh, looking forward to it. Down in Turner's Cross should be a good, uh, good occasion. So, I think everyone's everyone's just uh, switched on, ready, ready, looking forward to to Sunday. You mentioned a big occasion, a big crowd expected to. I know you've not played at Turner's Cross yourself, but I'm no. sure others of the players, other a few of the other players have. What are some of the things they've said about the the court crowd? And are, are you really excited to get down there yourself? Yeah, I've spoken to to Jimmy about it as well. Um, I think everyone I've spoken to about it says, says it, should, it should be a good good day down there. Um, we're expecting expecting a big crowd, like you said. So um, hopefully, hopefully it's a good occasion, and uh, and people come out to support us down there.